Hi Libra, welcome back. This is an 18 to the 20th reading for you, Libra. 18 to the 20th for Libra. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and the North Moon. We're going to get you a major arcana. What's your major arcana for the next 48 hours? Okay. For Libra, the scale, the justice, the empress, beauty, male and female, Libra. Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Moon, Libra. Someone rising, Jupiter, and North Node, Libra. Okay. Let's see what this is. Give me something for the August 18th to the 20th for Libra. The, the Tower. Wow. Okay. So a Tower, the High Priestess. Okay. We'll see what the Tower is. The, the Emperor in the World. So you have Tower energy coming in. This could be a good Tower. This could be a bad. We're going to have to see. Let's get one of these. Let's get one of these for Libra. Summer rising, Jupiter North. August the 18th to the 20th for Libra. Give me one of these for the Empress. Your Highness, the Ultimate. Give me one of these for the Empress. We have intuition again, so this is something that, okay, we have happy. Wow, so this is a happy tower. There it is. I want to be closer than six feet. All right, so this is a happy tower that's coming in for you, Libra. All right, let's get one of these. Libra, sun, moon, rising, Venus, and North Node. So this card has a woman here sitting with a man, okay? And there seems to be drinks on the table. So I feel like you're kicking it with somebody. This could be how you're dressed, sexy as fuck, kicking it with this man. Somebody is looking at you like you're crazy as fuck, girl. Let's see what this is for the... The end. I don't even know what she's holding in her hand. I can't make oh that's a video game. Oh, so maybe some of you um game. Okay, you okay, some of you. Or maybe the person you're dealing with their game or they play the game or something like that. What is this for? Um Libra. Sun Moon Rising, Jupiter and North Node. So this is a happy tower. You're actually happy about whatever this is coming in, okay? The 18th to the 20th of August for me. Libra, please. Let's see. Came out. We have not today. Not dealing, heard, avoided conversation, called person boundaries, and still angry. Wow. Okay. So, yeah, the sword and rose. Clarity, truth, revelation, solidarity, force, honor, protection, and power. So, you are protected here. You have the chaser. Someone's chasing you. You have sunglasses and stalking you photos they could even be looking at your photos right yet but i feel like you're you're happy you're in your zone or you're with somebody new or you're doing your own thing or or um you're with this other person or if you're not with the person because some people you don't have to be i feel like it's like someone's calling you or trying to get you like nah get away from me if you can't give me the truth with the clarity truth with uh revelation card then i don't want to talk to your ass just period yeah, because we got the high priestess as your overall energy, and I want to be closer than six feet. Yeah, somebody wants to be with you. They're watching you, stalking you, chasing after you. Yeah, chasing in a codependent relationship, fear of abandonment issues. You're like, no, nah, I'm good. I'm happy over here. You lie too much or, you know, something like that. Let's see what comes out in this one. People get like tired of the lies. Okay, like for real. Let me see real quick, because they're telling me to get this other one. Hold on. Put one under here, let's see. I'm also hearing you drink a lot of water. Okay, drink a lot of water, leave that. All right. The Empress, please. August 18th to the 20th. Sun and Rising. Jupiter, North Node, Libra. What's coming in the 18th to the 20th? Give me one of these for the Tower. Give me one of these for the Tower. We have home. So comfort, safety, and belonging, shelter. So this could be in proposal. 
and party. I don't know if this is a surprise, because happy is here. I don't know if this is a surprise, or a surprise party or um, a proposal or someone's popping up at your house or I don't know what the fuck this is. What's the tower in the home? But it's like you're happy about it, okay? Because you have the happy card here. Yeah, date. Courting, dating, anniversary. And someone wants to date you. This could be because I see somebody at someone's home. This is because the tower is like a, something that comes out of nowhere. It could be a good or bad, but with happy clarifying it, I feel like it's like somebody's popping up on you or you're popping up on somebody. I'm, I'm not sure what this is. Okay. We'll get, we'll get one more yeah, reconciliation. I, all right, surrender, letting go, release, give up, and patience, and change with spiritual awakening. I just feel like you have let go of a situation you've changed, or maybe somebody else did. Could be a Scorpio with the transformation card. But you've let go, released, and gave up on something. You've lost your patience. You just don't care, like literally. You're happy where you are, where you are with yourself, with this person, or whatever. You're like, nah. Spiritual awakening, proposal, yeah, party, and new love. Yeah, new love, okay? You're like, no, nah, I don't want to be bothered. Yeah, faded meeting. So somebody wants to reconcile with you. Date you, court, date, anniversary, meetups, um, reunion, second chance, back together, I miss you. Okay? But I feel like you've surrendered and you've given up on this. You're like, no, nah, you don't tell the truth, man. How can we build on something? How can we do something that you lie? Or you're a hater, or you're secretly jealous, or you do underhanded, grimy shit. What is this for Libra? That's not even that fucking serious. Like, people make shit more serious than the fucking need to be. Like, for real. What is this? Give me a couple of cards right here. I'll put one on the tower as well to clarify again. But this looks good. I don't see anything bad here. Leave a summer rising. Jupiter North Node, August 18th to December. Tell me about the Empress, the Ultimate, Your Highness. You yeah, have a twin flame card. What is this reconciliation, home and date? Yeah, divine feminine, there you are, Libra. That's you, the Empress. What is this? Yeah, we have desire and lust and sexual chemistry. I mean, desire, lust, sexual chemistry, and entrapment, pregnancy, money, heartstrings. I feel like somebody wants lust or sex with you. Somebody wants to entrap you or get you pregnant, Libra. Okay, especially if you're a female. Somebody wants to get you pregnant or something. Yeah, adventure, hideaway, and all this shit. What's entrapment and desire? Yeah, crushed, Bro sad, broken, feminine. Woman. So you may be sad, or for maybe a sexual encounter um, um, resulted in a pregnancy that you're not happy about. You could be a male, maybe a female got pregnant, you're not happy, or this is a you're you're a woman and you're mad about it or something. Yeah, rage, ready to yeah, somebody is mad about a pregnancy, or you're mad or something. Yeah, cleansing, meditation, clearing space, removing negativity and karma. Party relationship and lesson. This could be a karmic because this has been coming out lately that is trying to trap you. 818 on the clock. If you're a male, or this is, or or it could be either or. Yeah, trash today. Look, what is this? Pressure cooker, entrapment, and desire. Yeah, I saw the money card. Someone's trying to get it says pregnancy, money, heartstrings. So it could be a pregnancy, money, or pulling on your heartstrings, or it could be all three. What is this? Yeah, ascension. There's that spiritual awakening again. Spiritual path awakening. Okay, somebody's had an ascension here. All right. We have children, twin flames. Somebody's looking up twin flames as well. What is this for Libra? It's just too much. It looks like, yeah, pretending, fake, living beyond means, gossip. Okay, petty, jealousy, envy, uh, retaliation, punish, payback, and revenge, and denial. Not facing truth or irrational. I just feel like somebody's not facing the truth that this is over. I feel like insatiable desire, unquenchable wanting more past and reminiscing. Somebody wants to go back to a person from their past. So this is you. What's the retaliation? Gossip and pretending. Somebody wants to yeah, wishing, hope, praying, and yearning. Somebody's hoping, praying, and yearning that they can re retaliate, get payback on you or whatever. And with our angel Michael protection, prevent it from harm and divine intervention, it's a no. Just period. Our angel Michael is the most powerful um, archangel in, in the higher realms, the most powerful. And, the, and he's saying no. So I feel like somebody is wishing on someone. Yeah, twin flame, flame that. Yeah, because of a twin flame connection. I'm about to extend this. Twin flame, non-silence, silence, non-action. Twin flame, silence, non-action. 
and threatened. I just feel like somebody's threatened by it, um, this twin flame connection somebody has with someone. You're yeah, reminiscing because somebody wants to go back to the past. Somebody unconditional, genuine, a certain love. Somebody is threatened by this love that this person has. We saw the karmic card for their twin flame, but I feel like there's no communication, silence, non-action between the two of these people. But somebody's threatened because there's so much love. What's insatiable, unconditional love and reminiscing? Yeah, obsession. Someone's obsessed. And look, divine feminine sticking out. Um, period. Somebody's obsessed They're with their divine counterpart. Just period. Alien, telepathic, dreams, and songs, drama queen. Somebody's mad about this obsession with this divine feminine. Obsession and divine feminine. Someone is coming for somebody. Just period. They're coming for them. Yeah, meeting. Yeah, two or more people meeting, discussing, and planning, searching online records. Somebody could be searching for somebody online or whatever. Divine, feminine, unconditional love, and twin flame. I'm about to, yeah, magnetic, unexplainable pull, can't resist. Okay, irreconcilable differences, and there's your divine masculine with realization. Okay, so it's a divine masculine that wants out of a situation and a karmic is threatening them and trying to get pregnant and some more shit. So let's um extend this over on my Vimeo. The link will be in the description box, comment section, and in the community tab.